Just moments ago, a federal judge sentenced to accuse cop killer Devon Lyman for gun charges. The same gun authorities say was used to kill APD officer Daniel Webster. News 13 Sarah Yingling joins us live from outside federal court with details. Sarah? Yeah, Kim, Judge Christina Armijo sentenced Lyman to 20 years in federal prison, 10 years for the gun that he had the night that he is accused of killing Officer Webster, and 10 years for another gun charge. Now, back in October of last year, a judge found Lyman guilty of felon in possession of a firearm and ammunition. The gun police say was used to kill Officer Daniel Webster. He pleaded guilty to the other gun charge. During the sentencing today, Officer Webster's wife addressed Lyman for the first time, telling me he needed to hear me. I needed to look him in the face and tell him what I needed to say. The defense also played two videos pointing to the person they say Lyman is, one in which he is shown beating a man on Central Avenue, the other Lyman leading police on a foot chase. Now Lyman was supposed to be sentenced today on drug charges in a different federal case that involved drugs and guns and Lyman, that Lyman allegedly sold to undercover federal agents right before the shooting of Officer Webster. That sentencing was continued until April 24th. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Sarah. Now, in that federal case, Lyman could get up to 50 years in prison, and he, of course, still faces state charges for the murder of Officer Webster. Prosecutors are seeking life without parole in that case.